Coach, what does a weekend do for this group like the one you had this weekend? Well, you know, it's funny. I, I didn't think we had a strong game tonight. Uh, the other team was a little depleted. I thought we didn't come out how we wanted to. I get the three and three, but I was walking out the ice with Rookie, and he's like, we just took five out of six points. So that's what we need to do and uh, to, s to stay afloat here. So I'm happy about that, but, I mean, if, if we can't play hockey like that and ex expect to win some, some hockey games. We got lucky tonight. It's a good thing we have some good goalies. So, But we'll take it. Five out of six, get a day off. Come back to practice Tuesday and get ready for Wednesday. 30 plus saves for both Forsberg and Dilly on back to back nights. I mean, like you said, it's got good thing you got goaltending, but it, how difficult is it to get a, off to these slow starts and, and depend on them? Um, you know, it's it's frustrating to watch. I mean, I think they know uh, they know within that room what they need to do, and they they see what's happening. It's just. Teams are, are, are jumping on us and, and they're just hemming us in our end. I mean, it's, you know, it could be the shot clock's a little high for outside shots and stuff like that, but still, we can't give up those shots. There's going to be event, eventually our goalies are going to get tired and bruised and uh, banged up, so we just we got to knuckle down. We, we got some video to do this week and um, look at our D zone, what we have to do better. And it might not even be D zone, it might be more neutral zone. Where we gotta, you know, start eliminating them getting into our in our zone. So we'll we'll look at some tape and we'll, we'll go back to work on it. It seemed like the uh, goals came after you guys started to put the puck on net more, like you talked about last night. Yeah, exactly. I mean, after the uh, after the second period, I just told them like we're not shooting pucks, guys. We're not. We're waiting for the cute plays and. Our power play was, you know, we finally got one, but before that, when we had power plays, we didn't get in the zone clean, and when we did, we weren't shooting pucks again. I'm like, guys, we just got to put pucks on net and see what happens. That's all they were doing. They were chipping pucks behind us, uh, getting on the forecheck, getting it back to the point and shooting pucks. Uh, again, uh, it's a good thing our goalies have been on fire lately, or this could, uh, I wouldn't be as happy as I am right now. You don't sound happy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it's it's just it's frustrating because I, I told them that there's a lot in that there's a lot of good hockey players in that room and then we're just not showing it individually and as a team and uh, we need to snap out of this. Uh, uh, as a staff, we'll figure out what we have to do. But I mean, I can only push push them so far. I can I can't stick handle for them. I can't shoot the puck for them. They have to do that. So and it's it's that's I guess a, it's a development league, and they have to learn that. Because if they don't learn it, they're not going to go too much farther than this. Carlson with a pair of goals and back to back nights. How has his game developed over the? Time? His he's he's been a solid. He's been solid all year. For, he's had a couple of hiccups, but that's normal. But he's been real. You know, he just goes about, if you don't notice him, it's probably better, and then you know he's having a good game. And, uh, sometimes when you do notice players, you know they're having a bad game. So he just go about, goes about his business and and uh, gets the job done. And, and of lately, he's just been in the right spot at the right time. And what does he do? He shoots a puck. So. I know you've uh, been busy with your game tonight, but obviously, uh, I don't know if you heard about Crawford, was, went out of the game today up in Chicago. Are you worried that maybe Forsberg or Delia might get the call up? Well, I, yeah, we saw that when we walked in, we heard right away, but I, I'm sure somebody's going to go up. I'm not sure who, and I don't know how bad it is uh, in Crawford, so um, we'll see, but it, just as long as they leave us one of them, we'll be happy. Good. Thank you, Coach.